What is up YouTube, Silver Dragons here, and in this video I'm going to share with you my top 5 picks for silver bullion coins in the year 2023. Now if you want to purchase physical silver for stacking or investment, then this is the video for you. Let's do it! Thank you so much for watching. I do sincerely appreciate it. We're going to jump into the top five silver bullion coins of 2023. Coming in at number five, we have the Austrian Philharmonics. Now, they're actually the only coin on the list that does not have a person on the coin at all. It just has musical instruments. This side has a organ. And you can see above the 1.5 euro, the year 2023. I am filming this in 2022, but the 2023s have already came out, so that's pretty cool. Now, when it comes to price, because I know that's what most of you care about, these are usually priced sort of middle of the pack. They're not super expensive, but they're also not super cheap either so i would say you know kind of middle of the line when it comes to pricing unless they are on sale if they're on sale then usually you can get a pretty good deal on them so if you ever see a sale on philharmonics jump on it when you can because retail pricing on these again slightly higher than some of the other coins i will show you but still not outrageous now when it comes to quality the philharmonics they do milk spot they've been known to get these kind of ugly white spots on them and i'll talk about milk spotting for all of the coins i'm going to show you today but uh they're kind of less than desirable right and it's not like it really hurts the value of the coin that much but some coin shops will actually pay you less for milk spotted coins when you go to sell them so just something to be aware of but still all around a very solid coin coming in at number four we have the canadian silver maple leaf now these were my number one pick last year they're an absolutely gorgeous silver coin they are made out of four nines fine silver however when it comes to investing in silver it does not really matter if they are three nines fine silver or four nines fine silver either way you're going to get one ounce of pure silver when you get to four nines or five nines fine that really only matters for medicine and things like that so they kind of went a little above and beyond with refining their silver but hey still you get an absolutely gorgeous silver coin it does have quite a few security features on it as well but the problem with the canadian silver maple leafs is that they've just gotten way too expensive i declare bankruptcy they used to be priced about the same as the other silver bullion coins but now they're actually one of the more expensive silver bullion coins that you could be buying. So just like the Philharmonic, if you do find them on sale, then you should probably jump on them. But other than that, when it comes to regular retail pricing on these, I am kind of avoiding them just because I could get more silver for my money if I go with some of the other ones. But these still are a favorite among stackers. This is one of the few coins out there that will not milk spot. The Royal Canadian Mint started using the Mint Shield technology in 2018, and ever since then, their coins have been absolutely beautiful with no milk spots. So the older Canadian silver maple leaves, yes, they will milk spot. So be cautious when you're buying random date. But if the coins are 2018 or newer, they're going to look absolutely gorgeous the whole time you have them. Obviously, there are exceptions, but this has been my experience. Coming in at number three, we have the Australian kangaroos. Now, the thing I like about these is that they have a lot of the things that the maple leaf had going for it. The four nines fine silver. They have security features, but also the price is slightly lower than the maple leaf now one of the downsides to the kangaroo is they're not as available as all of the other silver coins here in america they're sometimes a little bit harder to find this is not always the case but i know not all of the bullion dealers carry these but when you do find them they're usually priced a little bit cheaper than the maples so for that reason i'm putting them at number three when it comes to milk spotting for me these have been about 50 50. sometimes i'll buy kangaroos have no issues with them for years sometimes i'll buy them and they seem to develop milk spots like the other coins so i guess it's kind of a toss-up but the ones that have developed milk spots have not been terrible it's kind of one little spot here or there 
So I would say all in all, the quality is very good. The Perth Mint is definitely one of the best mints in the world for quality. And so they're definitely a solid silver coin to be purchasing for investment. Coming in at number two, we have the South African Krugerrands. Now I know what some of you are thinking. Yes, these have had pretty bad quality control issues over the years. In fact, here's another one from 2022. And look at all of the terrible milk spotting on this coin. I drink your milkshake. However, when it comes to milk spots, like I said before, they don't always affect the value that much. In fact, one of the good things about milk spotting is you know your coins are real. Fake silver coins don't really milk spot. So it's almost like a security feature in a way. But really, when it comes to the Krugerrands, the price is usually lower than all of the other silver bullion coins, especially when they're on sale. So if you're just stacking for weight, if you just want to get as much silver as you possibly can, this is how you're going to be able to do it with silver coins. They're almost like a glorified silver round. However, they're very recognizable. Before I get to the number one bullion coin of 2023 I want to do a quick honorable mention and that is the American Silver Eagle on the left we have a type 1 on the right we have a type 2 now these have been a favorite amongst stackers and investors for many many years and in fact they've always been on my top five list until this year because the premiums are just too high on these coins now I cannot recommend them anymore which is really sad as an American I wish the US Mint would get their act together but it seems like they're probably not going to so unless the premiums come down on these coins I'm not recommending them anymore and my number one pick is the British Britannia silver coins wow these are absolutely gorgeous now before you go out and just start buying them there's something you need to know this is a 2023 type 1 Britannia it's called a type 1 because it has Queen Elizabeth on it however they're going to put King Charles on the Britannias as well in 2023 those will be called the type 2 Britannias now it doesn't matter which type you buy what you want to do is buy the cheapest Britannias you can find could be the type 1 could be the type 2 it could be a different year 2022 or maybe even random date it could be like a 2020 Britannia who knows but the bottom line is that the reason I'm putting these for number one is because the price is usually the lowest Britannias are very affordable when it comes to silver coins they're absolutely gorgeous they have a lot of security features as far as milk spotting goes they're kind of middle of the pack sometimes they milk spot sometimes they don't so it's a little bit of a toss-up but they're very affordable they look great and if you want to stack silver coins in 2023 these are my number one pick now i am curious what are your picks for the top five silver coins of 2023 feel free to leave a comment down below in the comment section i want to say a massive thank you so much for watching and i will see you all in my next one silver dragons out.